So I'm going to talk about something here that might seem inconsequential to some people. Uh, but it's actually really bothering me about this Pro Controller. And I'm sure some of you are experiencing in this and maybe not saying anything because it's not unheard of with controllers for this to happen. But this is the first controller it's happened to in my life that it's actually bothered me. So what am I talking about with the Nintendo Switch Pro Controller? I'm talking about this. See if that focuses in there. Look at that grind. Let's see how well. It's really bad on the right side, more so than any other side. But it is happening all around the stick. And it's happening on this stick as well. Although to a lesser degree, since I do not uh, use the right stick as much for movement as I use the left stick. Now... For full disclosure, this is my second Pro Controller. So yeah, I have one box, two box. And I was looking at buying the Xenoblade Chronicles 2 Pro Controller. I have decided against it because of this issue. And it's not like it's exclusive to this. If you look at another controller, right? This is another, this is a wired Nintendo Switch controller. Uh, I forget which company made it. Power A. Uh, if you look, it's grinding on here as well. However, I can't tell. When I'm going around like this, I can't feel that grind. I don't feel the grooves. It feels just like it did when I first used it. But when I use the Pro Controller, I don't know if you can hear it. It's not really an audible sound, but it's a feeling. And the problem I'm running into, and you can even see some of the dust there along the side is that it's affecting me when I play games. Uh, it's affecting me in Odyssey. It's affecting me most recently in Breath of the Wild. And I'm afraid it's going to affect me in Xenoblade Chronicles. Now, is it making me like the worst player in the world? No. But this is the first time that the grind on these sticks has bothered me on a controller. Uh, I have, you know, Xbox One controller. Let's see if I have it laying around... Okay, I don't have my Xbox One controller on me right now, but that controller also has some grind, but I can't feel it when I'm using it. When I, when I spin the stick around, I'm not feeling it, but I'm really feeling the grind on this, right, at this point and this point. And the problem is, when you're playing Splatoon, or you're playing any game that uses this left stick for motion, it's throwing me off. It's throwing me not only out of the game, because I can feel that grind, um... But it's also making me less accurate with certain things. Like I want to move, say, it, 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 in this direction here, but then it gets caught. See, you see that jump there? See that? I don't know if you could tell. It's like it's like making this millimeter jump um, that I'm not telling it to do. But that's because that's where the groove is pushing me. And if I had to say something, uh, that is the one flaw I think I exist with most controllers: the grind. Um, that I'm surprised they haven't found a way to fix the grind at this point, but is really bothering me about the Switch Pro controller. And what we have to remember is that this is a $70 controller. I've bought two of them, so I spent $140, and the reason I got a second one in the first place was because the first one grinded so bad. I don't, I don't even have it anymore. Uh, I, I, I sent it into the Nintendo taking advantage of my warranty. Still haven't got it back. Which I'm surprised, because you figured they would just send you a new one. But uh, the grind on it was so bad that you would go like this, and then it would get stuck right in this spot. I would move the stick around, and boom, it's stuck. I can't move it off there without a massive jump. And it's starting to happen to this one, too. And it, it, this bothers me. $70 product, it's not going to be under warranty forever. And um, I'm experiencing an issue... With, with, with severe grind and here's the thing i wouldn't even call myself you know a, a person that's playing the switch for many many hours per day because i'm not but i i do play it several hours weekly and this to me is just unacceptable not only the grind itself which is wearing down the sticks um but also the fact that it's affecting me as i spin the stick around i mean especially right there that's like the worst spot as I spin the stick around, like, you're mostly okay, mostly okay, mostly okay, bam. Right there, there's resistance, and that resistance is unnatural. So, 
I, there isn't really much I could do about it except send the controller into Nintendo uh, for repair, which means they're either going to just send me a brand new Pro Controller, uh, which I figure they would have done by now since I sent my last one in like a month ago, and they still haven't gotten it back to me. Okay, I should probably check up on that. Um, or they're just going to literally take out the stick and put a new one in, um, and they might do it on both sides. But it, the problem is going to persist because uh, it, this isn't a manufacturing issue. This is a design flaw, and I, I don't really know what they can do about it, but it's the first controller that really bothers me. Again, the grind is happening on this one to a lesser degree because I do use this controller less often. You can see it's all the way around, but it feels natural. I don't feel any resistance from it, whereas this one, there's a resistance point right, right there, right there, and that, that's not good. You can see that's actually where the grind is at the worst, is right up there. So, yeah. Not happy about that as I went to play Xenoblade Chronicles 2 today. Um, but it is what it is. Anyways, folks, I'm Nathaniel Rufflejance from Nintendo Prime. If you like this video, you know what to do. And if you dislike the video, hit that dislike button. Uh, I just really wanted to show you guys some issues I'm having with the Wii, uh, the Wii U, the Nintendo Switch Pro Controller. Um... I will be announcing the winner of our triple pack three uh, three pack giveaway along with a new giveaway later today. But uh, yeah, not happy, not happy with this seventy dollar product. This was my favorite controller until this issue started cropping up. So hopefully Nintendo can address it uh, with some higher quality sticks in the future. All right, folks, I will catch you in the next one.